Hello, welcome to September's empties video. It is going up a little bit late because life. So with that note, my quote from this little thing I found at the Dollar Tree is be bright, be happy, be you. All right, so I've got quite a bit of things that I want to talk about for the month of September. So I will get started with those. This item is from Tatcha. It is the Dewy Skin Cream. This was a sample or travel size or one of those like discovery sets. Um, so completely done. I like it. It's very moisturizing. Um, but I don't know that I need to get it again. I think it leaves a bit of my my skin feeling a little bit greasy so i don't really care for that feeling but it was nice so if you are a dry person you might want to check this out um this is another uh bath and body works antibacterial hand gel i love this scent the pink bubblegum scent um i got a lotion from ppu sometime this year and i thought it would smell like this and it doesn't so i'm working my way through that so once that is finished I'll share that with you, but this bubblegum scent is amazing. I wish I had this in a lotion. Um, this is the Diva Curl One Condition. I think this is a conditioner. I got this when I was a member of, um, oh my gosh, I can't remember the name of the, I think it's called Influencer, but this I got as a free gifted item to review and I'm not quite finished with it. It's down to here. So I'm going to consider this a empty, um, but I probably wouldn't get this again. I don't, I prefer a different type of conditioner feel um, in my hair. And this does not give me that. Similar to that other product, I got both as a duo um, in the influencer box. So this is the Diva Curl No Poo. Um, zero lather cleanser so I guess it's supposed to be a shampoo this is almost full um I don't know probably down here or so I think I might repurpose this as a shaving cream um or solution for me or just get rid of it I didn't really care for it I don't really care for the scent um so I'm gonna say this is a declutter for me Uh, the Onyx Bath House Foaming Body Scrub. This is my absolute favorite, favorite scent that I get from TJ Maxx, and it's $5.99. This sits at my sink. I use this um, to scrub around the nail bases here <clears throat> or around the skin around the nails um, to get rid of some dryness and to moisturize. As you can see, that's pretty done. This is kind of coarse, but I find that it suds up very well with water and um, it's not too harsh on my hands but this stuff is amazing I love it so I think I have like about a one or two more backups of this love it a hair care item uh, from bedhead self-absorbed this is the shampoo um, I don't know how much I got this for probably like five or six bucks uh, it has that red tag there from TJ Maxx or Marshalls. So it looks like Marshalls. Um, but this was great. Um, at the time that I was using this, my hair was a bit dry. But I found other products that work better for my hair than this. Um, not that this was a terrible product. But I found something that I like a little bit more than this. But if I were to see this on sale again on a red tag, I probably would get it again. But this is completely empty. Next, I have this Herbivore Aquarius BHA Blue Tansy Clarity Cleanser. Um, this was okay. I really love the feel of this bottle. Love the pump. Um, I love their Blue Tansy Facial like Resurfacing Mask as well as their Lapis Oil. Both combination if you have um, acne prone skin. Um, these those two products work beautifully this meh, i'm neither here nor there i bought it solely for the fact that it had blue tansy but i didn't really find that it gave me clarity as far as my skin goes so i just went back to using those other products recently 
But yeah, this was, eh, I don't need to rebuy this again. I have this white barn from Bath and Body Works um, hand soap. This is my number one scent from uh, that store. It's called Lavender Vetiver. Oh, this stuff is amazing. I had it in the foaming wash and then I saw that they had the gel or whatever. Yeah, the gel hand soap. Um, and then of course, as we know, Bath and Body Works tends to discontinue things. And this is one of those things. I wish they would come back with this because I would get all of it. <laughs> This was lovely. I think I have like five more bottles left of this and then it's over. I even had the um, home plug-in thingies from Bath & Body Works who loved it, but I wish that they had like a voting um, system where you can vote back a scent and it'd be permanent or something. But for now, I'm just going through my stock, but I just wanted to mention this because I love it. And last for this month, I have a nail product, nail care product. This is from Colores de Carol, and this is the Leveler, the smoothing top coat. I would consider this to be an empty, um, I'm probably just going to wash this little bit out. I already have a new one of this. This is my absolute favorite smoothing top coat. I know there's a lot of people that like other brands out there, but this is what works the best for me. Um, and... It works great with other top coats. So love this, already have a backup of it or a new one that I've opened already of it. And I will forever buy this particular product because this is phenomenal. Anyway, that ends my September empties. Um, so thank you so much for watching. And remember, be bright, be happy, be you.